The new TikTok rewards program has just landed and creators are getting paid even more than before. And for this reason, this is the easiest way for you to make your first bit of money online right now. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys six of the best niches right now to make the most out of this new TikTok rewards program. And make sure that you stick around until the end as the sixth niche is a niche that I actually personally have a page in. And this page has made me over $10,000 in less than five days. But with all of that being said, let's jump straight into it. And the first niche I'm going to be talking about is the news niche. Now within the news niche, there are loads of different sub niches that you can do. I'm going to highlight one here that I think is quite good and is quite untapped right now. And that is a celebrity news niche. There are a few pages in this space, but most of them are using a face and they have a face behind it. And for that reason, I think there's opportunity for someone to come in and create a really big powerhouse in the faceless space for this niche. I like this niche because there's always going to be things going on in the world for one, and more particularly the celebrity niche, there's always going to be celebrity dramas and things going on with celebrities that you can then report. And because of that, you're going to get tons of views due to the fact that celebrities obviously are people that have a lot of attention already and it's just a formula to go viral. It's so easy to go viral with this niche because like I say, they're celebrities, you can use things like their face and just basically the stories out there, there's already gonna be rumors around and people are gonna be hearing about this. So if they swipe onto a video and they see a story about, you know, exposing the news, then they're gonna be interested to see, okay, is this actually true? Is it not true? And they can just find out more about the situation. All we need to do is go ahead and take a look at YouTube and you will see how much viral potential there is with this niche, even with faceless pay. Now, as for how you can go about creating content in this niche, there are a few different ways we can go about it. So the first way is obviously like I've already said, where you use your face and you talk about the news in that way. However, I don't really think most of you guys are too interested in that and you prefer to do a faceless way. So the two main faceless ways is going to be to either create your own sort of cartoon character and have them sort of have a particular AI voice and they can speak over it. Or the way that I like most is just for you guys to go ahead and just basically just use B-roll and pop-ups and things like that to help create this video. And then instead of using a character, you'll just have a voice in the background. And that voice can be a voiceover from yourself, or you can just use an AI voice using Eleven Labs. Now I've talked about Eleven Labs a lot on this channel and it will be linked in the description. But yeah, it's just a great way that you can use to go ahead and generate AI voices for your pages. Now onto the second niche that I've seen doing really well right now, and that is the text messages stories niche. I personally know people that have had pages within this niche and do have pages within this niche, and they're all making some good money with this niche. And with that being said, there are multiple routes to monetization with this niche. Not only do you have the creativity program, like obviously this whole video is about, you can also get paid from apps like RizApp. So this app called RizApp, I know by some of my friends that are in this niche, uh, they basically pay you as if it's similar towards a creativity program. So you have to join their Discord. I'll try and grab the link and leave it for you guys in the description. But if you join that Discord then and you get accepted, they'll basically pay you per the amount of views that you get on their video if you incorporate their Riz app in a certain way. I'll pop up a quick example of what I mean where you say if you include that app. I actually have a full tutorial on how you can make these type of videos on my channel. So if you guys want to look a little bit more into this niche or you're interested in this niche, then I'll leave that link in the description so you can check it out once you've finished watching this video. The third niche that I'm going to talk about is going to be the quiz niche. This niche is great because there's pretty much endless ideas there is always going to be a demand for this niche and there are loads of different ways that you can go about creating a successful page within this niche one that i've seen recently that has been quite interesting is basically where the, the quiz game has like a host on the videos it's like a little character that they've animated or whatever and this character is talking to you as you're going through the quiz. I thought that's quite an interesting spin on it, but there are loads of different ways that you can put different original spins on it to try and make sure that you go viral in this niche and you're just different. If you're the same as everyone else, it's going to be quite hard. You can still do it, but it's going to be quite hard. If you try and add that own little original spin or something that's different, then it's going to be a lot easier to go viral and get a load of views with your page. Once again, these type of videos are really easy to make. All you need are some pictures from Google. Then you need an AI voice to go ahead and actually speak what is being said and a simple editing software and you can pretty much create these videos just like that. And a little bonus tip for this niche, if you are someone that can speak multiple languages or maybe English isn't your first language, then there is a great opportunity here to go ahead and take quizzes that have done really well on English pages and pull it over to your language. I've seen a lot of people having success with that and I even know a lot of people that have successful pages in like Spanish, for example, and it's a lot easier because there's just less competition and you can take viral concepts from, like I say, from English pages and pull it into your own language. One thing to be careful of though when doing this is to think about whether your language is gonna attract a good type of audience in terms of getting a good RPM. Obviously, as we know, if your audience is from, let's say, third world countries, 
then your RPM is probably gonna take a big hit. And because of that, you're gonna obviously make less money. So just something to think about. I've seen a lot of people having success with this as there's way less competition. And like I say, you can just use those viral concepts and bring it into your own language. Now, the fourth niche that we're gonna be talking about in this video is the cartoon characters sort of niche. This is essentially where you'll have a cartoon character from like a TV show, and they're just gonna talk about random things. That could be like random facts. It could be uh, stories. They could be talking about stories. They could be talking about like uh, life hacks, things like that. Just, they're just talking about random things and it's basically this character on screen, some background footage, some pop-ups popping up and then also you're going to need to go ahead and use Eleven Labs once again to create a custom voice around this around this character. This niche works quite well because the character and the voice sort of hooks people in and you can interest a lot of people if you use the right characters. However, you need to make sure the thing that they are talking about is something that's interesting. Otherwise, people are not going to continue watching, which is going to harm your video and it's going to basically make it not do as well as it could do if you had people staying and watching the whole video. Another thing that I think is another great positive to this niche is you can use it to sort of have an impact on your RPM. So if you use the right characters and you try and target the right countries like America, like maybe try and find some shows that are really popular in America and mainly just popular in America. And if you can take these characters and put them as like the sort of host on your show, then most of your views will most likely come from America, which is going to lead to you getting a better RPM as the people in America are going to be the ones that are interested in this kind of content, which then means TikTok is going to push your content to those people. So that's just something to think about because this can have a big impact on your RPM and actually have an impact on how much you're making with the TikTok rewards program or creativity program. Now to make these videos, you're just going to need some photos of the characters that you want to use. You're also going to need a script. So different ways you can do this is you can write it yourself. You can use AI like ChatGPT to help you. You can take inspiration from other pages that maybe use different characters, wherever it may be. You just need to get yourself a script and then also you need a custom AI voice using Eleven Labs. Now to go ahead and create this custom AI voice, you'll just go ahead and get some footage of these characters speaking so you can clone their voice and make them say whatever you want. So you just need to go ahead and get some isolated audio of them speaking from the TV show, whatever it may be. Put this into Eleven Labs and you have your own custom voice. And now when you put your script into Eleven Labs and you select their voice, then it's just gonna basically put whatever your script is into their voice. But yeah, these videos, once again, are quite simple to make and it's just some simple editing and some simple little tips and tricks and you've got your video. Now, the fifth niche I'm gonna be talking about is the games niche. This niche covers a lot of different games such as put a finger down, higher or lower, press the button and just games like that. These are going to be totally original videos. Once again, like I've talked about all of these in here, that these are all gonna be totally original videos that you can use to make money of the creativity program. And they're once again, they're simple to make. And there's always going to be demand for these type of games as well, as they're quite interactive and they're also entertaining. I'm going to talk a little bit more in depth about the put a finger down niche, just because of the fact that I've been looking at this niche quite a lot recently and I've been seeing it doing quite well. So the other ones is the same sort of things apply, but this is a niche that I've seen doing quite well recently. Now with this put a finger down niche, the reason that I think it's doing quite well right now and I like it is because with the hooks, you can address the viewer straight away. And you can also play on their emotions. And if you've seen any of my other videos before, you know I talk about this a lot and how it has an impact on keeping people watching their video, getting people hooked into the video. If you can play on their emotions, it's just going to help you keep people watching. And this niche is great for that. So for example, your hook could go something like this. You are ugly, put a finger down, ugly edition, something like that. So straight away, you're calling them out saying you are ugly, which is just going to like confuse people. And they make sure they don't scroll off straight away and they stay on to hear the part Whereas put a finger down edition to see if you're ugly, then they're probably going to be likely to stay on the video just to play along and see what happens. Now for this niche and a lot of other different niches that I've talked about throughout this video, you may want some background clips that are like satisfying clips, especially in the put a finger down niche. This I've seen these, these clips being used a lot. I've actually compiled a folder filled with these clips. If you guys want to go ahead and get those for totally free, you can join my free discord in the description and in the free resources section, I'll have a link where you can go ahead and get those clips for yourself for totally free. Now a sixth niche, and this is the niche that made me over $10,000 in five days, is the clips niche. Now I know this is a pretty controversial niche and people say all the time, this niche doesn't get monetized, you can't make money with this niche and things like that. Uh, while there is some problems with this niche, I can tell you guys from experience, you can actually make some great money with this niche. Now, like I say, this niche did personally make me over $10,000 in less than five days. With that being said, it does have some issues with the originality of the content. And that is actually why I made $10,000 in five days, because if I didn't get kicked out, I would have made a lot more than $10,000, put it that way. But I got kicked out after five days. However, in that period of time, I made over $10,000 and I got to keep it. As if you get kicked out for unoriginal content, you get to keep the money. So there are some problems with this niche in that sense, but the how easy it is to go viral and how good the RPM seems to be in this niche, I feel like the, the pros and cons sort of balance out because of the fact 
that you're gonna get you're gonna make a lot of money in the amount of time that you are in it and there are different things that we can try and do to make it less likely that we are to get originality strikes and things like that and you can be a little bit cleverer which is what i'm going to do when i get back in with this page but for that reason i just wanted to cover this niche because obviously this is a niche that has worked for me and i don't just want to share a bunch of other niches that i don't have foolproof myself that actually work but with that being said on the point that people say this niche doesn't get monetized and things like that as i'm quite a big page in this niche i talk to a lot of other big pages in the niche and they all say the same things. A lot of them are making good money of this niche. I know one guy has made over $50,000 in this niche. So like I say, there is definitely money to be made of this niche. You just have to be a little bit cleverer and a little bit more careful in this niche with how you go about it. Things you can do to try and make it less likely you're gonna get kicked out when you are in this niche is just adding extra pop-ups you know, using multiple clips and trying to keep these clips under 30 seconds and then try to avoid using clips like movie clips or sports because those get striked pretty easily. But like I say, this niche does come with some issues, but at the same time, it does also come with some positives. And that is all the niches that I'm going to cover today. With that being said, when I say these niches in videos, it does obviously push a lot of people to go ahead and try these niches. So if you guys want me to create a video breaking down how you can find viral niches for yourself before someone like me goes and makes a YouTube video on it, then drop that in the comments, just let me know and I'll go ahead and create that video for you guys. If you did enjoy this video, then it'd be much appreciated if you could drop a like. And if you want to see more content like this, then make sure to subscribe as I post weekly videos helping you grow and make money with social media. Now, if you want to watch the video where I explain how I made over 10K in five days with the TikTok creativity program, then check out this video on screen over here. Apart from that, I hope you all did enjoy and I hope to see you guys in the next one.